Hello there, I'm Forge Tech, and I am here with the Nuka Cola delivery bundle and the Fallout First item nine ball table. Now, let's start with the nine ball table real quick because you know, when I saw this in the shop, I was a little disappointed. I was sitting there going, Wow, it's a you know, orange table. We already have these in the game. I was like, Oh, when I went to place that, I said, Oh, well, the rug is also included. That's nice. Uh, as I walked up to it, I was like, okay, it looks nice. It's, you know, it's a good little item. You know, I was a little like, eh, okay, well, that's when I noticed this. It's like, yep, it is an actual interactable item. Your character will walk around and play the entire game. And you get two charisma. All in all, I it just it went from meh to actually kind of cool. I mean, it's it does look nice. It does have that whole out the wasteland finish. The little rug looks nice. All in all, kind of looks like it could belong in any base. But you can see the little. Alt tech inspired stuff. I mean, you know, it, it's one of those. If I hadn't seen it, I probably would have passed by it kind of deals. But that's your Fallout first item. You get that through Fallout first. Now, the Nuka bundle, you've got this. Starting off, we have this little thermostat. And it's just a little nice wall decoration. It's, you know, slightly cute kind of deal where. He's drinking out of the new coal and it goes up and down depending on temperature. I don't know if it works. I don't think it does. I think it's just a static design. Now, I have the little Sweetie Pete vending machine. Now, thankfully, they slowed down this guy's animation because it used to be just him going woohoo every 15 seconds. And it would slowly draw, you know, to the point that you wanted to uh, basically strap a bunch of nuclear grenades to him at some point. But they actually slowed down the whole animation. It does have this nice quantum finish. Uh, he has this little, as you can see, he's got a little fog inside of it. He seems to have two animations that I've seen. The first one is he does the whole standard woohoo and raises his hand and shakes candy. You actually look at his hand over there. It's actually full of what I assume is candy. Actually, I kind of hope it's candy. Uh, I might explain why some of the raiders in the wasteland are going weird if it's not. Um. Okay, so his second animation, he does. Like I said, it's slowed down now. It'll actually all these little. Let me see if I can trigger it by turning them off and on again. Well, no, nope, didn't work, but he actually has these spin around. A cup actually appears. If I actually hear him, I'll walk back over. And then a cup will actually pop right off his chest. Full of uh, Nuka Cola Quantum, I assume, because it's blue. Next up, we've got this little chair. You know, standard chair. I mean, it's nice looking. It's got that little, you know. There it goes. That's his standard one. Where he shakes the candy all over the place. And he shoots sparks and everything else out. Like I said, the new Coca-Cola cast stool, I like this. I mean, it's it's a nice little... You know, it's got the little worn look to it. It definitely fits the whole theme. I'm a big fan of anything that I can use in multiple camps. Because it feels like you get more bonus out of it. But all in all, nice item that could go in any camp, raider, settler, whatever. I mean, now we have this. I thought this was actually a table originally. I was like, and I guess you could use it as one, but it's actually a trampoline. The animation's a little bit jerky, but, you know, let's be honest, it's funny. It's a funny item. 
it's you know it's supposed to be just more for amusement than an actual thing all in all it's you know like i said it's it's cute it's kind of funny definitely something i see a lot of people just randomly jumping on when they go by your base doesn't seem to you know like do anything beyond that but it could also be used also easily used as a table you can put a bunch of chairs up to this uh does have that design to it now this is called the nuka cola planter i'm assuming i've tried to put different plants in it like carrots and corn and stuff none of them would fit so i'm assuming when it says planter it's meaning as a decorative planter rather than an actual useful planter as far as I can tell, I've spent quite a few minutes trying to put anything by running it along the entire edge. But overall, really nice decoration. I mean, it's this little weedy box type thing. I mean, it's actually pretty interesting. It's nice to see more clutter items. You know, when you're trying to fill up a base and you don't have a lot of clutter, it, it looks... It just looks wrong. You know, it's like when you walk into a house that's perfectly everything in its place, it just doesn't feel right. You know, you want all the shelves to have books and everything else. And so having these little extra decorations that, you know, fill up the space to make it feel more lived in. Then we have this Nuka Cola truck, and, you know, I put it on the foundation here to showcase it can go on foundations. Which is always nice because, as you can see, it's on a little 2x2 two two style foundation. It's got this little, you know, like, door flap open. I put this little ramp over here for a second, so I could show you up into it. It does have a whole engine block and everything else with it up. You know, all in all, I mean, like, I could jump up here every aspect of this is good if you like really small camps it's great um really nice place for a vendor since it's very easy to spot from a distance you know you could have like a roadside you know vendor spot uh that anyone could just stop in and see it's really nice looking i think this is honestly the out of the entire bundle, I would definitely say this is the best piece out of it. Um, it looks good. It's always nice to have a lot of small... You know, it's a small kind of prefab that can fit in a lot of different designs, which is always great. I mean, you could put anything. It's already got built-in stairs. You don't have to do all that sort of stuff to it. And with that, I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I hope y'all have a good week.